So this is Ryland Dodge. Say hi, Ryland. Hi. Ryland is playing the role of the vicious twink <laughs> in the Cinderella effect. Uh, a character without a name, but with a name regardless. With an attitude. With an attitude. Uh, so tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, I grew up in Pearl Harbor, Hawaii. Um, started out drawing and then got into singing and then got into theater. Um, I went to Shenandoah Conservatory. Um, and then after that, toured for about three years with um, a lot of different shows, a lot of different musicals. Then moved to LA and have been doing lots of shows out here, luckily. And um, the sporadic film project <laughs> or commercial or whatever. Were you a vocal music major or theater? Um, it was music theater. Music theater. So it was, um, and because it was a conservatory, it was like you had all the theater classes, all the music classes, and then, you know, your design classes and stuff like that. And actually, I switched my major um, halfway through to um, theater for youth, which was basically like uh, theater with an emphasis in design. It was the most design and art classes that you could take. Theater for youth? Mm -hmm. Did you travel with... Uh any theater for youth tours? Yeah, um, actually in school we did, uh, there was a group called Shenandoah Showmakers and they would go around to different schools and environments and perform and I did several shows with them but then um, once I graduated I worked with a theater company called Theater 4 which um, for about a year and a half I did three tours with them and their tours were usually about six months. Um, I worked with a show called Hugs and Kisses which was predominantly for kids from you know, uh, uh, kindergarten through, you know, fifth or sixth grade, generally fifth grade, um, to teach them about um, good touching, bad touching, and secret touching. And it was actually, the show started in 1981 and um, is still running. And it's uh, a public service show, essentially. And so um, I worked with that show for about a year and a half, which was awesome. But it's very, it's very difficult when you tell people you did a musical about uh, touching. secret touching. <laughs> but it's actually a great show. So you're getting married in two days? No, I'm, get, I'm flying to the East Coast. Um, I'm getting married uh, 9, 10, 11. So I will be getting married in about a week and a half. Where at? In uh, at the Crown Plaza um, in D.C. Because it's legal to get married there. <laughs> That's awesome. Congratulations. Thank you. Um, how long have you guys been together? We've been together uh, five and a half years, That's which awesome. is why I came out to LA, because I was just I w I ended my contract with the company that I was with Theater Four, um, and I was going to move to New York. And Jake, my partner, said, "Well, you know, I just uh, I just applied for this graduate uh, film scoring thing at USC, and not a lot of people get in, so I probably won't be doing it. But if I do, do you want to go to LA with me?" So I'm like, okay, well, I guess, um, thinking, of course, that that's not going to happen. And, of course, it did happen. And now he's been very, very successful and doing lots of films. And luckily, that sort of makes things work out so that I can do a lot more theater than I normally would do. Well, that's awesome. Congratulations. I'm, that's, Thanks. I'm very happy for you. Uh, tell us a little bit about your character, The Vicious Twink. The Vicious Twink. Well... I, it's a little confusing because I think that he's actually, I mean, obviously a very typical West Hollywood uh, <laughs> guy, twink, um, which is oh so lovely. Um, <laughs> but I, I don't think that he's quite as, I don't know, quite as vicious as he may seem. You know, he does attempt to, you know, uh, he does attempt to help Randall when he, you know, when his glasses break and, you know, he does the thing with the drinks, but it's so that he can sort of warn him about how everything really is. And, um, you know, while it might be unorthodox, maybe not as vicious as interpreted. In interpreted. Interpreted. So, so he's kind of vicious with a heart of gold. Sure. Yeah, let's, let's give him a heart of gold. Like Julia Robertson, pretty woman. Absolutely. More like uh, Catherine Zeta-Jones in America's Sweethearts. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, that's awesome. Congratulations. I'm Thanks. very happy for you guys. That's awesome. And have a very safe trip. And thank you very much. Thank you. Wave bye.